I have got a dessert for you. It's a trifle, and it's an improvisation. There's no recipe, but you don't need a recipe. I have about four pounds of ricotta here, pureed it until it was absolutely smooth in the food processor. Oh, one other thing, it has to be whole milk ricotta. Don't fool around with the skim milk stuff. Okay, now I'm gonna flavor it. So the first thing that I want in it is a bit of sugar. Not too much, because ricotta has sweetness all to itself. So, sugar. And I want to do a little bit of zest. I want to give it some sparkle. So we're going to do some orange rind. And by the way, do this over the bowl because all the oils that are thrown up, they go in here. So they, they flavor everything. There we go. Now some lemon, a little snap. And now I want just a little bit of almond extract. Oh, the smell is fabulous. And then a little bit of vanilla. There we go, just a teaspoon or so. You're gonna stir this all together. Look at that, I mean, is that not just sensuous? I was the daughter to a, a woman who loved to cook and when she'd sit down at the table, especially when we had guests, it was so embarrassing because she'd taste something she made. By the way, this is my first layer of cream, just in case you wonder what in heaven's name she's doing. My mother would taste something, and she'd close her eyes, and she'd really, you know, get into it. And then she'd look at everybody, and she'd say, isn't that wonderful? And of course, you know, what could people say? Okay, this is pound cake, could be angel food cake, could be leftover cookies, could be stale anything, just something a little sweet. And now, a little liqueur. It could be maple syrup, okay anything a little just a little flavoring and then we defrosted frozen raspberries and lightly sweetened them but oh imagine in the summer fresh peaches and nectarines oh be fabulous and you want to put some of that color on the outside because that's where it's going to be splashy looking like so okay got it great now, next layer, and be generous, for goodness sakes, there, and there, and now the next bit is the cake, a little bit of that amaretto, not too much, rest of the raspberries, and then the big finish, big finish is whipped cream. And what we did with the whipped cream is we sweetened it very lightly. Now you want this to really be as sexy as it can possibly be. So this is not a dessert where you say, I'll use low fat this and sugar free that. You have a tiny bit of it. This is gonna serve 12 in a twinkling. And what I've got here, green pistachio, and then a scattering of the fresh raspberries, yeah. And <laughs> that's your trifle, right there. Improvised trifle. Flavor it with whatever you want. So easy, I cannot tell you. Great dessert.